What's up, YouTube? Today I'm gonna show you how to go from this super like blurry and so FPS is trash to this. See, I got a full 160 now. You watch the video. Let me show you the steps and everything you need. So I hope y'all enjoy. The first thing you gotta help is step one, which is changing your resolution. If you play on window full screen window it can make your game very laggy so my suggestion to you is to probably switch to full screen and some people play on like this full screen they say it helps your game with FPS and then, but it looks horrible it don't look good at all but if you want to play on this man you know, go ahead the thing is your monitor if your monitor is like 144 AZ you have like a low end PC or a like medium NPC then if you have 144 then make sure you got it on 144 because if you put it too high it can put too much work on your PC and that's not good because your PC can overheat and it could damage it a lot so make sure y'all do that but again if your PC isn't that good make sure you um if you're on 144 just go on 120 because going on 144 it can make your game work too hard to reach that but if you have it on 120 it's still kind of smooth but i play on 144 so that's what my monitor is 120 is smooth though if you have a a, a low end pc use use uh 120 for graphics uh the key resolution gonna play a big role because if you have your stuff all the way down that's how it looks it looks like this this is what it looks like if you have it all the way down so make sure that you don't have your 3D resolution all the way down. Make sure like all this extra stuff is off. But you don't really need it. You don't need all these all this extra stuff because it puts a lot of load on your GPU and CPU and it makes your PC work itself a lot. So my suggestion to you is to put like near put all this on. Make sure off off textures low, effects low post processing low, BC off, motion blur, that's up to you, FES, you know, keep that on, all this other stuff, I just keep it off, to be honest with you, and make sure you're on DirectX 11, because DirectX 12 is not good at all, alright, next step, I want you to do is, look, if you're on a lower end PC, or medium end, you get a lot of FES drops, you wanna go here and you wanna go to performance mode. I wanna show you what performance mode looks like and how much FPS I get because it boosts FPS. So I'm gonna reload up Fortnite and I'm gonna show y'all. Alright, I loaded him on performance mode. You see the builds look choppy and they look like mobile builds, but it it gives you best performance and better FPS boost. Like if you put it on like unlimited see I'm touching like 430 right now I'm touching 400 FPS this is amazing this is really good I'm not gonna lie if you have a lower end PC your PC isn't that good or your graphics card isn't that good put on performance mode and you will be touching a lot more FPS this is amazing please put the setting on if you want good FPS performance mode is a good mode for people who have low budget PC or lower end I have a, like a, a medium high, medium slash high, so I don't really need to use it, but if you want to use it, I always put this on. Alright, next thing you want to type in, is you want to go to your pressure windows button, and you want to type in performance, and go to adjust the appearance and performance of windows, and make sure you have adjust for best performance, do not put let one of those choose what's best for a computer well if you have a low end PC then you can pick but I will still pick adjust for best performance because it will give you the best performance so yeah another thing is to close out all your tabs that you got open while you're playing Fortnite unless you need them like if you need discord or another app to keep it open but if you don't need it then close it like epic games launcher I don't need this so I'm gonna close this I don't need 
this anymore, so I'm gonna close it. So all I got open is Fortnite and basically Discord. But these are the only two apps that I have, ever have open when I'm playing Fortnite. So make sure you close all of them apps. And next you wanna do, you just wanna go here and TA is already here. So you wanna type in edit power plan. Click on that, and then you go to power options and this is the preferred plans. So we got ultra performance, provides ultimate performance on higher end PCs. You got uh, high performance, power saver. Which one do is you want to go to high performance because it favors performance, but it may use a lot of more energy, but it's better for like lower end PCs and stuff. So once you go to that, it will be good. And that's one of the steps. Alright, well, if you like this video, can y'all leave a like and maybe subscribe because it's free. And I'm just here to help y'all out. I'm here to help y'all help people that just got PCs that don't know what to do. I'm gonna make another video soon on like more settings and stuff for uh, new beginners with PC. So I hope y'all enjoy. Leave a like and bands out.